What is up, you guys? It's D Black Boy, aka Black Boy, that best nig on 360. And there's <laughs> no gameplay or commentary here. Actually, I'm gonna start doing the random clash generator. So this is this is live, by the way. This is live. So I'm going to be showing you guys what my random class gonna be. And the first option I get, I have to pick it, and I have to do decent or pretty good with the class. I'm not trying to do like a B score like 70 kills or 60 or 50 whatever but a nice little decent gameplay like 40 maybe 30 kills who knows but anyway i'm going to start doing this random class generator so let's type this in random class hold on random class generator model for three and i'm gonna go on the first one there we go and it finally came out i was so happy when it came out man so i'm willing to load whatever oh you want to see my twitter real quick here's my twitter and follow me on twitter man Follow me on Twitter. My name is Black Boy or D Black Boy right here. So just follow me on Twitter, and you know it'd be cool. And you can learn why I upload all my videos and all that good stuff. But anyway, here we go. Let's roll this baby. Y'all ready? All right. Level 82. You see that? Level 80 right here. So I'm already level 80. I'm gonna get where I get. Ready, set, go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right. Okay. All right. <laughs> This is a funny class. So the primary I have the US the USAS twelve with the range holographic sight. I don't even have holographic, I don't use it. But I'll just use range. Screw it. And if I unlock if I don't get good gameplay by the time I get holographic sight, then I'll use holographic sight. I got the MK fourteen with focus red dot. I could okay, okay, I can work with that. And then I have Claymore, Scrambler, and Juiced. Wow. And I have Recon, Overkill, and Steady Aim. Oh. Alright, so I have to use Support Kill Streets, even though I hate support, but whatever. Got UAV, Airdrop Trap. I don't know who fall for those anymore, but whatever. And Advanced UAV. Okay. So, you've seen it here. The first attempt, the first try, whatever. And I get this nasty class. So, in a couple, like maybe a week or two, I'm gonna get good gameplay, whatever, and I'm gonna post on my channel and just talk about the game, talk about how I feel about the perks, and how crazy this class is, alright? So, anyway, this is D Black Boy, aka Black Boy, the best nigga on 360, and I'll check you guys on the gameplay. Peace. What is up, you guys? This is D Black Boy, aka Black Boy, the best nigga on 360. And I'm here with another mod for 3 gameplay slash commentary. But this is a gameplay I haven't done before. This is actually the Random Class Generator Episode 1. And I know you guys have been waiting for a while for me to do this. And honestly, man, I was just waiting for the website to, you know, to start running. And I was waiting for the program to start working. So finally, I went on Google. Like a week ago, I was like, hmm, let's see if it's up. And it was up, running nice and fine. So I decided to, you know, do it, get, get a gameplay with it, and put it up on YouTube. And I went 36 and 8 in this gameplay. Not bad. I mean, it was domination. And yes, I could have got more kills, but you think about it, the class I had was actually pretty bad. It was It was pretty bad. It was okay for a random class generator at least, but I felt like it was really bad. Like the fact, the main reason why, not because of the guns or the perks or anything. The main reason was uh, the kill streaks. I was using support, and my support was um, it was airdrop. No, it was UAV airdrop and advanced UAV. I had no kill streaks or whatever that got me actually kills except for the airdrop. And actually, surprisingly, people still fall for the airdrop, which is really sad. But I did get some kills with the airdrop. Not this gameplay, but I did other gameplays. But people were falling for it, so it was pretty funny. But, I mean, that's the only, like, support kill streak I can use to get me kills. Other than that, UAV and Avenged UAV. I mean, those are good, but I just... I, it's, it was just so hard to get gameplay with this because, like I said before, my kill streaks didn't help me get the kills. But it is what it is, and 36 and 8, I guess it's an okay gameplay for Domination, but it could have been a lot better. Of course, if I had, like, a MP7 silencer, or a try-hard class, or whatever you want to call it, 
then yes, I will probably have like 50 kills. But anyway, so let's talk about the gameplay. You already saw my class and everything. The video before this one. Like I had, I put up two videos in one video. You know, like the first video before this one was just me. You see, you see me live. Like that was live. Like you saw me like pick the class random, and you know I wasn't cheating because as I was, it was like a live commentary kind of like as I was talking, I was uh, typing in the website or whatever and rolling the dice or whatever and getting the random class and you saw it. So I mean, it was live and there's no way I could have cheated because you saw me get the class or whatever. So, I put two videos into one. I put that video into this video. So, this is a new video. And there we go. So, you already saw my class, my kill shoots, and everything. So, now I'm going to be talking about the gameplay here. So, you see, I, I got my MK14 out now. I get my advanced UAV. I think my second one, I believe. Maybe it was my first. I'm not sure. Because I wasn't really paying attention. But I blast that dude. And I kill him. Let me talk about the class. This class was really hard to use. The fact, because I already talked about the kill streets, it was hard, it was support streets. Even though I don't like support in the first place, it was just the fact that it didn't really help me. So I had to, all my kills were gun kills. And not only that, like the USAS, it was a, it's an okay shotgun. It's actually pretty, it's okay, it's really inconsistent because there be times when I have to shoot the dude three times. And there be times when I actually get one hit. And I had to use, I used holographic sight, and I didn't unlock range yet for it, because I never used a shotgun. And that was part of the thing, I had to use range, but I never had range, so I was using, uh, what was it, kick, I think? Yeah, I was using kick, so, you know, sorry about that, but what can you do? I wasn't going to, like, try to rank it up to range, and then try to, you know, use it from there. I was just going to use it, just to use it. So, whatever I had, I was just going to use it, so, you know. It is what it is, and man, the use, like I said, the use ass is pretty bad. It's really inconsistent, and the kill shoots were bad. MK14, it, it was okay, it was okay, but I didn't like the uh, perk overkill because I just feel like it's a pointless kill, I mean, uh, perk for me. I just don't like overkill. I feel like it's perk, uh, I'm about to say perkless. I feel like it's pointless, so I don't really like. Uh, overkill as a perk anyway, but you know I had to use it. it is what it is, and but that wasn't the worst part. It's mainly because of the use ass and the kill streak, but it's whatever. And this class is really hard to use, man. Like I was trying so hard to get at least over 40 kills and at least under 10 uh, deaths or whatever, but that was just too hard. I tried. So this is my best one, 36 and 8. That was the best one I was going to get. I already knew that, so. It was whatever, and I did want to post this up anyway, so I did get my I did get my advanced UAV again for the third time, second time, not sure. But let's talk about the gameplay now, and so I bring out my USAS again. And sorry guys, we end up losing this game, but I tried. You know, you you have to. It is what it is. When you have teammates that are just bad, you just have. <laughs> what can you do with them, man? What can you do? But I blast that dude. I just blast him right in the freaking throat. And I call my advanced UAV. Advanced UAV is really good, actually. That, that was my favorite one, of course. And I jump up and kill that dude. And then I'm laying down. Stuff I was coming out, avoid that, luckily. And I couldn't get that dude. It was too far. But it's whatever, so. And, yeah, I did ask people in my last video, whoever, I forgot when I said that, but I was asking people. Oh, it's the Mamba Black Boy, episode 11. I was asking people, should I put the round class generator episode within the Black Boy, the Mamba Black Boy episodes? Because I'm going to be talking about the gameplay anyway, and uh, both of the episodes. Like, I'm going to be talking about what I'm doing in gameplay. But I asked people, and they said that they wanted to see a separate and they want to see a separate thing, so that I'm just gonna keep it separate, guys. I'm gonna keep the round class generator separate and the mind of black boy separate. So that's what I'm gonna do. And I actually don't mind that. That's actually I think that's a better idea because you know I just didn't want to put it together and make it. It'll, it'll get confused and it'll be all weird and stuff. So it's whatever. So I got my MK14 out again. I shoot this dude. Try to take my beat. Nope. And either way, I was gonna die by the stealth bomber. So look at this dude. Look out. 
The biggest cat. How can you just camp right there, man? I just don't get that. How can you just camp? But luckily, I beat him. I beat that dude in the gunfight. Man, AK-14, man. It is actually a really good gun. I don't see a lot of people using it that much. Because it's like a single fire. But, man, I'm telling you. Give this gun a try. Like, I will put red dot with a stinner mask. Or maybe, uh, rapid fire is okay. But I will use a stinner mask. Like, red dot is a stinner mask. And as long as you have good aim with it, man. It's a it's a really good gun. Like you, if it's mainly like two shots. If you get two shots, like the chest or above, I mean the chest or below, whatever, that's a kill. Maybe three, maybe three if it hits like the legs. But the chest, that's two shots. In the head, it's one shot. So it's a really good, a really good gun. As long as you know how to aim with it and if you don't have horrible aim, then you can do really good with this gun. And that's pretty much it. So, this gameplay is actually pretty over. Dang, that was... It was a long gameplay, of course, because it's falling and it's domination. Look at us getting dominated. And I was pretty much not trying to die a lot because I hate dying a lot. And it, it, it really just sucks because it makes your score look bad. Like, you go like 50... Not 50, but you go like 40 and like 19. That look, I mean, that's a good score overall. That's a good KD. But for YouTube and the gameplay, that looks so... I don't, you just die too much, and people don't want to see that in the gameplay. They want to see you, like, do good, do good, only die, like, single-digit deaths or whatever. So, anyway, I really did enjoy this random class generator. It's a really fun thing to do, and you guys should try it just for fun. It's really fun, so I'm going to keep doing this, keep the episodes running. And this is D Black Boy, a.k.a. Black Boy, the best nigga on 360. I hope you enjoyed this thing, and if you did, give this video a thumbs up, and put in the comments if you want to keep seeing me do more. And I probably will keep doing more. Alright guys, I'll check you later and peace.